Hi everyone! So this video is a tag video and it's the There's More To Me Than Makeup tag. So it's a series of 12 questions which really have nothing to do with makeup or beauty. Which is good. <laughs> it's a bit different. Um, hopefully you will learn something new about me or something that you didn't already know. Even though a lot of you, if you've watched my videos, you probably already know quite a bit. But you never know. So let's get into the question, starting with number one. Do you go to school? If yes, what is your favourite subject or what is your major? I don't go to school anymore. I finished high school nine years ago. Um, so yeah, <laughs> well out of high school. Um, but when I did go to high school, my favourite subject was ancient history. Um, and probably my second favourite would have been English. I liked English as well. Uh, number two, do you work? And if yes, what is your job? I do work. I work full time and it's very full on. Um, long days, long weeks, etc, etc. Um, but I work in finance and it's, you know, it's tough. It is long hours, um, long days, very demanding work definitely um, but I enjoy it I find it rewarding getting to help people um, so yeah I like that about it um, before that I mean I've worked in a couple of different places my first job when I was just before I turned 15 um, I started working and I worked in a video store um, so that was fun, that was really good. Um, my first job was the video store. After that I worked retail um, with cosmetics and just general retail and I worked in a school for a while as well. So that was fun. Uh, number three, do you read? If yes, name a few of your favourite books or magazines. I don't really read to be honest. Um, I just, I find it really difficult to get into books. Some books that I do enjoy are from Jodi Bacult. They're really the only books that I've actually been able to get into for a very long time. Um, so yeah. Number four, can you cook? I think I can cook. <laughs> um, particularly if I have a recipe to follow, definitely it's I can cook. No problem at all there. Um, I can cook from nothing, I guess. I, I cook by taste a lot of the time. Um, but yeah, if I've got a recipe, I can cook pretty decently. <laughs> Number five, do you have any siblings? Yes, I do. I have a younger brother. Number six, do you speak any other languages? No, I don't. I wish I could pick up on language, basically. I, I just can't. It's not something that I'm able to do very well. Um, I learnt a little bit of Japanese in high school but that was going back to 97-98 um, so my first few years of high school and I remember some of them still uh, I don't know if it's gonna make any sense at all I yeah I'd, but I, I remember saying um, something along the lines of it's cold isn't it or it's hot isn't it is um, Samui Desne or Hatsui Desne, um, or, and to agree with that, you'd say So Desne. Um, you know, there's Hajime uh, Mashite, I don't know, something like that. Um, Arigato gozaimasu. Um, there was one more that I remember, but I've got absolutely no idea what it means, and I'm probably saying it really poorly, considering my very bad um, accent that's attached to this. But it's something along the lines of, um, is, I don't know if it's Kore wa nan doku desu or Tore wa nan doku desu something like that I don't know what it means um, it may be what is the time or where is the toilet I don't know if you understand Japanese please let me know if I made sense and please ignore the really bad accent sorry but yeah so I don't really speak other languages very well. Um, number seven. If you could holiday anywhere in the world, where would you go and why? I would go 
to a few places actually. But first and foremost, I would love to go to the United States. Why? I mean, come on. Shopping. Why else? Oh, and um, Disneyland or Universal Studios. Because, yeah, I'm just a big kid at heart. So, um, not to mention the shopping. I have never been inside an altar. Um, which I know that sounds silly to a lot of you guys because it's just like a chemist or a drugstore, but yeah, I want to. Um, I also want to go back to Sephora. Yeah. Um, so I, I wouldn't mind going to Hawaii as well. Um, I like Hawaii. I like the volcanoes and that kind of activity on the other islands. I like the Waikiki. I love the Cheesecake Factory there. It's awesome even though you have to wait for ages to get in. That's fine. It's okay. Um, I like Ala Moana. Beautiful shopping centre. Um, and the shopping is amazing. But yeah, so I hopefully will get to go there next year. That's the plan anyway. Uh, my family and uh, my boyfriend and myself all want to go to Hawaii and possibly fly over to LA from there. So we have to start saving. But I think it's worth it. And who knows, maybe I'll be able to meet a couple of you guys that are over there. That'd be fun. <laughs> International meetup. Um, but yeah, so <laughs> we'll see. Um, apart from that, I mean, I'd love to go to the UK, not quite sure where in the UK, Canada, because I think Canada looks beautiful. Um, it looks very similar to um, New Zealand in some of the photos that I've seen. Uh, and New Zealand, I, I want to go back to New Zealand, because New Zealand is absolutely stunning. It's, it's gorgeous. Oh, you know, I would live in New Zealand, because it's, it's so pretty. And the people there are really, 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 really nice. Um, but yeah, so there we go. Uh, number eight, what is your idea of the perfect date? I mean, I'm not, I'm really not high maintenance or anything like that. I, li I like the rainforest, that kind of environment more so. So maybe just a walk through a rainforest, like a bushwalk, something like that. Um, or paintball. I like paintball or skirmish, whatever you want to call it. <laughs> um, number nine, what is your dream career? Hmm. So I wanted to be a criminal profiler, yeah, a meteorologist, um, like a storm chaser kind of person, um, but that would mean that I'd need to move countries and that was hard. Um, for a very long time I wanted to be a volcanologist. But again, volcanoes in Australia, sorry, it's not going to work. Um, so, yeah. Uh, I would like to be a teacher, a um, primary school teacher. I don't think I could be a high school teacher. Um, primary school, definitely. But I guess dream job, I mean, I love photography, if I could actually study it and learn more about it, um, make up. I would love to be op to be able to open my own store in Australia and sell brands that are so difficult to get for reasonable prices. I mean, we are talking a dream job here because reasonable prices for cosmetics in Australia, that's a dream in itself. So, yeah, that would be my dream career, I guess. I like that. <laughs> um, number 10, are you athletic? Do you play sports, work out? Or are you a couch bunny? I don't really work out. I should, but I don't. Um, I don't really play any sports. I used to. I mean, when I was younger, I used to play soccer and netball. And I used to do professional swimming and dancing and self-defense or karate. I wanted to do kickboxing, but my parents said no. Um, because basically I had some orthodontist or orthodontic work to my teeth and um, yeah they didn't want me to do kickboxing because I could get kicked in the head and uh, my teeth would go all manky again so yeah <laughs> um, but at the moment no not really I don't 
um, it's difficult because of my working hours to be honest so anything I do do I need to be able to do at home so I at the moment we don't have a lot of room in the house for exercise equipment because otherwise I'd probably have a treadmill or like an elliptical or something like that that I can use but we don't have room for it so I can't have that um, but apart from that I do like doing yoga or pilates i've got some dvds that they they are pretty good and it does work number 11 what are your three favorite things that have nothing to do with makeup or beauty by things i'm guessing it means like not living things so i would say my computer and my video camera because i can take photos on my video camera and take videos and upload them to my computer and I guess my phone as well. And the last question is, what is the best thing about you? Or about me? <laughs> um, I think the best thing about me, at least I think so anyway, is my personality. The way I see it is that at the end of the day, that's who you are. That's everything. I mean, you can get old and you can lose your looks and lose absolutely everything, all material items, but you're still left with you and yeah, I think it's important to be open and honest and be proud of who you are, I guess, I mean, and that comes with experience and age and yeah, so I think it's, you know, it helps you find the person that you're going to be with forever. Um, it just takes too much energy, in my opinion, to keep up a, a lie or an act and to act differently around different people. And it just, it's a waste. It's wasting time. It's wasting time that you could be spending finding somebody that's right for you, finding people that are right for you. And it's just a waste of energy, always lying to people. and acting to be somebody else that you're not and I just I couldn't be bothered to be honest so I'm just gonna be me and and not everybody is gonna like that not everybody is going to like you and it's not wrong and they're not wrong and that's just the way it is not everybody gets along with everybody you know and that's fine it's, you can't change that but you just need to make sure that you're happy with who you are um, and just stay true to yourself. Don't be somebody just because you think that's who you're meant to be. Because it's not it's not worth it at the end of the day. So yeah, that's that. <laughs> but that's the last question. So I hope you guys enjoyed these questions. So I might tag a couple of people specifically, um, but if I don't list your name, please I still tag you. <laughs> Anybody watching these videos, I tag and I'm more than happy for you to do a video response. All you need to do for that is just upload the video onto your own channel. Go down below where the comments box is and just to the right of that there's like a, I think it's the same for you guys, but that's how I see it. And there's a video response. And then you just drop down and you select the video and Bob's your uncle. That's it. Um, but yeah, so I, I really like watching these kind of tags because I think it helps people learn more about you, like who you really are. Um, I hope you guys enjoy them, enjoy them as well, or find them interesting at, at least. But yeah, that's it, and I will catch you guys later.